When Donovan started preschool, we realized that Donovan had a bit of an awkward gait. They did um, a full set of x-rays and determined that from a skeletal standpoint, Donovan was perfect. Now we're hearing the word neurology. The neurologist knew that we were dealing with Duchenne's muscular dystrophy. Eventually, most of these boys used to die before age of 18 years. Duchenne was not an adult disease. However, things have changed in the past few years with new treatment modalities and improvement in the comprehensive care that we provide to these boys. When I first found out that steroids was the best course of treatment, I really appreciated the transparency that Dr. Virapandian offered, said this is the only course of treatment that we have right now, but there are a lot of clinical trials and things that, you know, are progressing for better treatments. He let me know that there were risks, but just having had all the information laid out in front of me, I felt like I was able to make the best choice for us. Um, I am excited and I hear about all these treatment modalities because kids used to die in the past. Now we are able to do something to prolong their lives. But um, the question comes is, is it, how meaningful is it? Yes, we are prolonging their life, but how burdensome is that for the caregivers? Are we really providing true quality of life? That's that's a huge question. We don't know the answer for that. Um, but I do think I'm excited to hear all the progress. I'm really, really hoping that the treatment that we've chosen and the clinical trial that we've chosen to participate in is going to make a huge difference in his quality of life. And honestly, I want to see my child not have to be in a wheelchair, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. For now, I'm just happy for him to enjoy this time and his mobility.